part. I thought, why don't I offer an insight into everything that I think I've learned after 25 years in the classroom, plus the things that I've seen on my travels into one series. My name's Ross, uh, been a teacher in London in high schools uh, for 25 years. Um, I'm just a teacher sharing ideas. Uh, I want to make the classroom an easier place for teachers. Uh, we're going to look at the research that I've unpicked with retrieval practice. Retrieval practice dates back over 120 years. Week three, we're going to look at memory. Uh, so I'm going to give you an advanced lesson on memory. I do think if you understand memory better, you will become a much more effective teacher. Then number four, something that I'm currently looking at, I guess in two or three aspects. One, in my life at supporting schools uh, in observations and teaching and learning culture. Two, academically trying to evaluate teaching and learning more reliably. And three, trying to reduce the bias that we all have when we observe other people, uh, particularly from, an off, uh, from a school inspector's perspective. And I think you'll find episode four quite fascinating. Um, the last session is going to just share a, a, a new piece of research published in June 2020, which unpicks kind of 17 hallmarks of great teaching. So I'm going to present it to you from an engagement perspective, which would be particularly te about, uh, useful for teaching online. So I'll share as much as I can where appropriate throughout the five weeks.